today? I th it felt like 59. Did great. Congrats. Start up front here with Daryl. Yeah, John, a lot of chatter during the, the preseason about the transfers, the freshmen. Did it surprise you at all that Keon Brooks was the guy that stepped up, kind of jump-started the game for you? He played good. He's way better, way more skilled. Um, you know, I, I think uh, Davion fought. I love what I saw from Davion today. Um, you know, what, he didn't make any threes. What was he? One of five. So, you know, in a normal game, he's going to make more than one of five, you know. But uh, um, what I would tell you, 20 assists, nine turnovers, the way we're playing with the speed we're playing with was pretty good. Um, we could have had, we, we held it at times instead of, you know, a drive, pass, 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 drive again. We went drive, pass, and that guy tried to make a play. So we, we got to keep working on that. But the, the biggest thing became our interior defense, where in the second half, you know, Jamal just went crazy, 12 out of 17. So, again, we got to figure out. Like, and, and I'll be honest, I have not zeroed in on it. But I told him after the game, if you can play interior defense, you're going to play for us. So you want to play? Play interior defense. Um, you know, I know Oscar was out, and he's been, been – hip's been bothering him, so I left him out the rest of the game. Um, but it doesn't matter. We had other guys that, you know, we tried two or three different guys to, to say, let's go, let's see how you do. Didn't do very well. But – Short of that, there was some good stuff. Questions, Kyle? Like John Hale in the middle. Kyle, do you expect CJ and Jacob to be ready for that Duke game, and kind of where do they fit into this if they're when they are? Here? We don't know yet. I mean, I you know Jacob practiced like one day, um, but we're coming down to the wire right now, so uh, it'll be hard. CJ has not started yet, so it'll be hard. Um, but if you ask me and, you know, we could, we get to eight, there's a couple guys, you know, that, you know, it's just how it is. It's, you you want to play more guys, you just got to play better. I mean, again, um, uh, severe, you know, six and one. And the great thing is Ty Ty had 18 points on nine shots. What? And he didn't get the ball early in the game. Like he wasn't like involved, he never wavers, just plays, which is great about him. John, uh, Hopkins said the other day that uh, what he was looking for in this game was cohesion, how well they played together, 20 assists. How well, especially on an opening night, did you feel like they shared the ball and they played as a unit? No, I, I there were, there were times that they needed to make one extra pass and the guy that got it, and you got to understand, they're trying to establish who they are too. So it's natural. It's not selfishness. I'm trying to get this, I'm, you know, and, but we're trying to get to where the ball moves a little bit more and we keep driving. And we did it later. Um, but, um, yeah, I, I just, I come back to, um, we didn't turn them over as much as you would like to, which you got to give them credit. Their guard play uh, played well. Their big guys literally did not turn it over and got shots up every time. Um, you know, we got a ways to go. There, it, there was good stuff, but it's glaring to me what I got to do now. And forget about Friday, Tuesday, next Friday. It's the path that this team's got to go on is what are we going to be t t uh, perimeter defense? I thought Savir did a great job of fighting screens. You know, we got some other guys that were running gaps. We just were not playing that way. We, um, we got beat on the bounce, and you guys and ladies know how much we work on staying in front of a driver. We just didn't, you know, didn't seem to do it.
Cal, you've talked about wanting to be a speed team this year. It looked like you all were really trying to push the pace. Did you live up to your expectations today with that? Yeah, the only, the only reason we started pressing the way we were doing it is I just wanted to speed them up and get the game going the way we wanted to. How much we're going to press, I don't know. Um, but I like that we can press with our guards. Like they can pick up and play, and, and you're not going to get beat on a the dribble. They're going to stay in front. Um, but we ran. I mean, and what happens when you play with that kind of speed? It's usually about 12, 13 minutes into the game, you'll get a little bust out. And then in the second half, about the 10 minute mark, 11 minute mark, 12 minute mark in there, you get another bust out because it just wears on the other team. You just keep running. And, um, you know, like I said, I thought we had a couple guys that didn't play with the kind of motor they need to all the time. It's not just making shots. It's flying up and down the court. It's, again, if a guy's playing you, like he's, you're struggling to guard him, play him before he catches the ball. May not deny him, but you're going to control him a little bit instead of him controlling you. But that takes a high motor. Or you can wait till he catches it, and then I try to guard him. But I'm just saying, it's not the kid's fault. I told him after, how much have we worked on interior defense? Literally, I haven't. I've spent, we've been more scrimmaging this year than I've done in years. And the main reason is we got 10 guys, and they like to compete. So we're, we're getting stuff done. But the, the breakdown of the defense, we have to get back to what I've done normally. And again, if we're what we could be defensively, we could be good. If we're not defensively able to turn people over, if we're not able to have interior defense, it's hard to win. Unless you can score 95 and hope they score 93. Uh, John, 29 three-point attempts tonight. Is there a number that you would like to see the team average from, from deep? That, that may – my son said to me, you know, we took 29 threes. I said, what shooting what, – what, what was the percentage? He said uh, 37. I said, okay, I'm good with that. You shoot 37, 40 percent, you probably should shoot 29 threes. Um, my thing is, if you watch this, and I imagine a lot of teams watch this, they're going to say we're taking away threes. Well, it ain't all bad for us because we are a driving team. So we will try to get to the rim. Or hard closeouts. I love it how we play. But they'll be saying, well, they didn't throw it to the post. We, we need to work getting Oscar the ball more. We haven't done that um, enough. But uh, let me just put it this way. We got a lot of work to do. Cal, about the three-point shooting, Keon, I think, is 23% from three in his career before this. is four or six today. How much has he improved that over the course of the summer, and is that a weapon in his He's back? improved all of that stuff. Um, my thing, and I keep coming back to him, your skill set is really elevated. Um, you, you're going to think I'm crazy. I liked when he was screening the ball because then he would step back and be wide open. You know, when normally you're trying to – corral the ball. Well, if that guy can shoot and he steps back, you got a problem. So I kind of like that, what I saw today. But again, he got to fight, rebound more. Like a couple, he rebounded, he was tired, and that he looked to pass it instead of when you rebound it, you go with it. You're the point guard. And he did it later and he made a pass and I think he got Davey on a layup. Um, we're even faster if those guys can bust it up the court and then make easy plays. But he's, he's gotten better. Cal, another one on, on Keon. After the blue-white game, you kind of suggested there's two spots that you're really looking at for a bunch of guys to compete for there. Is that how a veteran uh, should step up and, and kind of address that? He, he probably heard some of those comments. And well, he had, well I, I'm not just saying it to the media. I'm saying it to them. If, if there are a group of guys, like Davion helped himself today because of how he guarded. Like, it's not a secret if you're watching the same game I'm watching and you say he really guarded, and Cal has said 50 times, the guys that fight and really guard 
and he'll dive on the floor and go rebound, they're going to get more minutes. Well, he's got more minutes. And he was one for five from the three. Doesn't matter. You can stay on the court if you defend that way. If you're breaking down defensively and you're one for five, well, let me stay in. What? Same communism, my man. You've got to come out. And so this team needs an interior defender other than just Oscar. Who is it? I don't know. Jacob raised his hand. I said, okay, it could be you. Two more questions, guys. Back middle. Uh, this is a big game for Wesleyan. Um, what, what is it kind of like to host a, an in-state game like this? Well, they did it. They, this was a great game for us. And I told Coach, they did. I said, you guys bullied us a little bit. And I said, I love it because we, we have to play the exhibition game based on finances for the tennis program and all the other programs. Most teams are doing what? Playing scrimmages. So when we play an exhibition, we got to get something out of it. We got, and most of it is I got to learn about my team. I learned today. There's some glaring issues that we got to deal with. But I saw it. And if we didn't play a team that would battle us, we would never know. And then you go and you get into your season and you're like, geez, we're not what we thought. Today we learned. And I, I'm hoping that it helps them and their pride and their, um, you know, uh, confidence in what they could do this year. Um, their guards were quick. You know, we had to fight to stay in front. And I thought we did a fairly good job. I mean, I, I would imagine a couple of their guards said, you know, I was surprised they could stay in front of me because they're quick. Uh, but they only turned it over 12 times. So, and we were pressing them, trying to wear them down. Didn't wear them down. Wore us down, I think. Cal, tonight we saw a pretty evenly distributed set of minutes tonight. No one even went over 25. Going forward, do you continue to plan to use such depth? Well, so why do you think I played all these guys? Why do you think I played that many see, instead of seven or eight? See who would play interior I defense. need to know who's defending, who's going to fight, and it's your choice. How about this? I'm a college professor, and I'm giving them the answers to the test. Here it is. I'm telling you what it is. Well, I can't play that way. It's not a problem. I still love you. You can stay with me at my house. I'm just not playing you that much. you got to fight. You cannot give up on plays. That's not acceptable here. And so we, well, I did pretty good offensively. So did he, and he fights more. So, you know, that's, you played them all. Everybody got a chance. Now we'll watch the tape. Well, if I would have played more, yeah, you'd have got less rebounds. So don't tell me that. You got your minutes. What would you do? Who took advantage of their minutes? Who do you think? Name one. Davion. Davion took advantage. of. He didn't start. He could have pouted. He didn't start. Who else took advantage? You can go down and say there are three or four guys. See, you're just looking offense. I'm looking at, I told them, this is going to be, I need dogs. Who are the dogs? Come on. Show me who you are. I don't play that way. Okay, I got it. You just move back a little bit. And now you, you, you're, I tell them every day, the first fight you have is with yourself. You can't fight somebody else unless you fight yourself. And fighting yourself means you don't stop when you feel like stopping. And if the energy is raised, you raise yours even higher. It's physical. My physicalness is going to be more. That's how you begin to fight other people. And the fight doesn't mean fist fight. It means I'm going to battle. Either he gets it or I get it. Who got it today for them? He fought more than we fought. Just how it is. I mean, so we'll learn.